morning from Paris, France. We have arrived to our Airbnb and today we are headed to the Louvre, which is very exciting, especially for my sister who was an art history major. I'm very excited for her to get to see so many of the paintings that she has studied when she was in college. And we're really just excited to go explore Paris today. We have very special dinner plans this evening and we can't wait to take you along with us. We are here in our Airbnb in the first district. So the Louvre is only about a 10 minute walk from our Airbnb. Here is the view out of our window here in Paris. It is so beautiful. This street down here is full of very high-end shops. I mean, you've got Louis Vuitton and, oh my gosh, Prada. I don't know, all of them, Valentino. All the brands that I don't know anything about or buy, but I know a lot of people are really into that, and so it's kind of a really special area, and all the buildings are just so beautiful. This one over here has these faces. Can you see all those little faces right here? Let me zoom in so you can see them better. They are so cool. Every once in a while, there's a face that's a little bit different. And then there's lions everywhere. It's just absolutely gorgeous here. So we are gonna head out this direction and we are going to the Louvre. So off we go. Virgin of the Rocks. of this art. It is unbelievable. Oh, I do love her. You are correct. I like her furniture too. It's so fun to see all the dresses and furniture and their hairstyles. I like her little pillows. <laughs> it's beautiful. So amazing. We decided we needed a break after just seeing the Mona Lisa and a few of the halls. So we got some snacks. We're gonna eat outside and cool off because one thing we didn't know about the Louvre is it is very hot in there. We were all sweating like crazy. So we're gonna take a little break, get hydrated, and then we're gonna go back in and probably spend the rest of the day here. This has changed my life. Literally, I have passed up eating a macaron most of my life. I thought they were dry pastry cookies and I have never wanted one. Even when there was no other dessert option, I passed them up and I can't believe what I've been missing my whole life. This is a pistachio one and the outside is like a little shell, almost like a, the outside of a Skittles, if that makes any sense. And then it's this like moist cookie inside with this like creamy pistachio gel. I don't know, it's fantastic and my world has been rocked. I've been missing out. And this is at the Louvre, so this is probably like a fast food version, so I can't wait to go to some little shops here in Paris. 
Bonjour. We just had a little snack, a bite to eat, and we got hydrated, and we are sitting here at the Louvre, and we are about to head back inside to see more. We've already seen Mona Lisa, and now we're gonna go to the Egyptian area, and then we're gonna go see some ancient Greek pieces, and we're very excited about that. This little cafe was the perfect way to escape the crowds. Even as crowded as it is inside and outside, seems like there's not very many people out here on this cafe terrace. They're probably so busy looking at art, but we're gonna go back inside now, and this was the perfect little 20 minute break. Got some fresh air, because it is hot in there. You had the saddest look before you saw me. Was it sad? No, I was just wondering like what, they look sad over. But it's a butterfly, maybe they're happy. Oh, oh it is. It's a maybe they're just in awe over the beautiful oh, butterfly. Thomas Toft Pottery, my teapot and my coffee mugs. I think this is a real mummified head. What does it say for number two? It's in French. We'll have to translate that. It's a great one. Oh my goodness, let's show you what's behind us. Check out this mountain! We're getting soggy. We are. <laughs> I love that you just said soggy. I haven't said that word in so long. It feels so good because inside the Louvre it was so hot. We had to escape the Louvre because some kind of an emergency made us. It was really fine. scary for a minute, but everything is fine. There I may have been a, a few tears. Alarm. There may have been a few tears. It was a false alarm. Everything is fine. And we also mixed up our days. We actually got to the Louvre and realized we mixed up our hours. And then about 20 minutes later, we realized, no, we mixed up our hours and our days. They were so nice. So we didn't have tickets. No, but they, they were for tomorrow. Some. They were for tomorrow. <laughs> they gave us some and they were so kind and helpful. Actually, everyone at the Louvre was. Everyone so far here. Yeah, it's been wonderful. So now we're just exhausted. We're gonna go back and take a break, get some coffee and freshen up because this girl has a surprise birthday event tonight and so does her sister Sophie and they don't know where we're going. You're gonna know before me probably. Do you have any guesses? I have no clue. No clue? None. I told her to dress fancy. Okay, bye. <laughs> We are all dolled up and we are ready to head out for the surprise dinner. The girls still don't know where we're going, but they're going to find out in about 20 minutes. Oh, 
거. the rides here in Disneyland Paris have been a lot more intense than the same ride back home but we're gonna go on Ratatouille next and then we're gonna have a dinner at the Ratatouille restaurant so that should be really fun This is where we have reservations for dinner tonight and we are all so excited. They don't have this back home, only in Paris, so we had to take advantage of it while we were here. fun than it looks, by the way. We closed this park down and we are going to the next park to close that one down. Cheers to Disneyland in Paris! <laughs>
going on a pirate ship. picnic under the Eiffel Tower. There she is. And I can't talk because I had so much fun in Disneyland and I went on all the scary rides and I screamed and I can't talk. So I haven't even really vlogged today. Today's just like recuperating from Disneyland and we're eating olives and we got crepes and churros and we have wine and happy birthday cups because that's what the grocery store had. <laughs> okay, I will see you guys later. Cheers, sister. Cheers. <laughs> Happy birthday to someone whose birthday it is. Not us. Daniel Day Lewis. Eh, he's I like great. Him. But anybody else's birthday? Let's see. Who else's? It's got to be somebody else's birthday. Are any of you having a birthday right now? April 29th? <laughs> Cheers to Daniel Day Lewis and any of you who have a birthday today. Well, yeah. uh, tons of people. Okay. Michelle Pfeiffer. To oh, Michelle Pfeiffer. To oh, Uma Thurman, Jerry Seinfeld. to Jerry oh, Seinfeld. <laughs> Who else? Uh, Catherine Langford. Oh, Catherine Langford. Dale Earnhardt. Oh, Dale. Dale Earnhardt. She loves Dale Earnhardt. It just says Dale Earnhardt. Then it's so senior, senior to Dale Earnhardt. Rest in peace. <laughs>
Does it look like you? I think so. Oh. I feel like I look a little more. <laughs> you look kind of sad. But yeah. beautiful. I think it's because I was sitting there for so long, I kind of lost yeah. it in my eyes. <laughs> it's beautiful. Pistachio? Pistachio? Alors, pistache, nuts, mm. and pistache, almond. Pistache, almond. raisin, figue raisin, mm. red fruit, Nutella, mm. nuts, nuts, almond. Wow. Yes, nougat. That's incredible. You want to try another flavor? Oh, pistachio. This? Pistachio. Oui. It's like what's in a Snickers. Yeah. Yes. But way better. Oh, way, <laughs> way better. Way better. This is worth it. We lost the nieces, but we don't care. Merci beaucoup. I mean, let's get this. Yeah, we'll buy some of this. Oh, he brings out the big one for it. Ah, uh, no, it's too much. Uh, yeah, we, we. That's what. That's our dessert tonight. Smells like sneakers. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, it does, it does. <laughs> Look at this palm tree light. Have you ever seen anything that cool before? Oh my gosh. It's all glass. It's amazing. Look at the coat rack. Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. <gasps> Look at the pottery. Oh my goodness. Everything in here is incredible. I think everything is newer made in the mid-century modern style, but I don't know for sure. I'm only guessing that because there's multiples. And sorry about my voice. I still haven't got it back from Disneyland. Oh, let's go around the front. Let's go around the front. Merci. Oh, wow. Look at the bowl over there. This is amazing. It smells like a sauna in here. Look at the chair. This is overwhelming. I love everything. I have to see how much the horse is. 950, it is Batosi, it's signed. Yeah, blue Batosi.
there's more. Are you serious? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> How did we find this heaven on earth? What does it say on the tag? Jean de Espiance. Wow. It's so cool. Shall we enter? <laughs> We've been seeing mushroom lights everywhere. <laughs> Whoa. Look at this lava glaze. The art. I love these chairs. They're like kind of like your chairs, but with like the Sherpa. Mm. I feel like Fuzzy would make this look so dirty with oh his black God. hair. So fast. Jeez. Where do they get all this stuff? I don't know. <laughs> this is amazing. Very is expensive. <laughs>